Um, my college experience was very interesting. I feel like I had an experience that not many people had considering I went to an HBCU. Um, it was an experience that I know I could not get anywhere else. It was both a blessing and a curse. There was a lot going on with Howard from cold water in the dorms to rats to administration stealing our money. Um, I really enjoyed my college experience in terms of the people that I met and the business and social acumen that I built. Um, <clears throat> I think it was kind of lacking in terms of the social experience. So far, my college experience has been great. Um, it's been great making new friends, joining different clubs and organizations, just being very involved on campus. I feel like that really helps in getting your college experience. Overall, my college experience is pretty good. I uh, made a lot of lifelong friends. I learned a lot of material that I needed for my current career. And um, honestly, I, I feel like it was a one of a kind of experience that I could not have experienced anywhere else. Really getting accommodated to new school schedule, really getting deep into classes, really figuring out how can I really train my brain to study, 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 study. Uh, I knew I was there for a purpose, but it was just so difficult to do that because I never was used to it. The toughest part of college for me so far has been my experience in transferring. I transferred from an HBCU, Florida Agricultural Mechanical University. And it's just been a difference in college size and class size and just the difference in the cultures of the school. The toughest part um, about college was balancing my schedule, especially being a collegiate athlete. Uh, in my elementary school and my high school, I was smart, so it wasn't hard to get an A or B or C plus without trying, but in college it was different because I was taking classes that I've never taken before. Um, the toughest part for me was juggling that and the military and having early mornings and getting off work, coming home late, have a two-year-old tend to, and then still have to move. log into a computer and knock out some hours on online courses. Challenging part of my two-year college career had to be adjusting to being so independent and having so much freedom on campus as a freshman, you know, coming from a two-parent household. The best ways that I've learned are more smaller group hands-on, whereas like I really do not prefer online classes, nor do I prefer lectures. They are annoying. Um, yeah plus in lecture classes if i have a question i won't raise my hand because like i said i don't even like talking in front of big groups of people i'm really an introvert the best way i learned in a college setting is an environment where the teacher makes him or herself more available to the students whether it may be for you know office hours or maybe a teacher that might give practice tests just a teacher you could tell is passionate about teaching and less about um, meeting certain metrics. The best way I learn in a college setting, um, I'm big on, I would say like using note cards. Um, when I think about how I studied in undergrad, I had to use note cards. I had to rewrite and write my notes again. Um, I definitely had to pay a lot of attention in class um, and then study outside too. That's just how I learned best and, you know, picked up different concepts. Best ways to learn is cause definitely use your resources. As far as resources, I mean your teacher's assistants, your, your teacher, your professor office hours, your colleagues in your classes. Things that I would change about college would be encouraging students to utilize the mental health resources on campus more. Another would be making sure that the academic advisor is best fit for that department. It's so important for each student to have the best experience that they can in their academic advising meetings. What would I change about college? Okay, I would make there be no tuition because college tuition is very expensive or make it like more accessible to get money for college. It's opening up, just meeting uh, a lot more people, just really networking with people that you don't even know, different diversities, ethnicities, all that. I have a good mixture, but not enough. Setting up a way that like makes it easier to navigate. Um, I know that a lot of times students have kind of um, issues in the first semester. 
For me, the best part of my college experience was when I finally got acclimated and just lived in the moment, just going to so many different events, showing my support, getting involved, and just connecting with different types of people, some who I even keep in touch with today because they help me in areas that they specialize in themselves. The best part of my college experience was 100% studying abroad in Barcelona. Um, I was there for four months. The best part of college, I would definitely say, is meeting new people, networking. Um, you just never know who you're going to meet and what they may, what purpose they may serve in your life. All the connections that I've made and just the ways that I'm able to take what I'm learning and apply it to real life and help those around me on and off campus.